Hi boys and girls, Coach Marty here on the campus at Carpenter. We're going to be doing ball skills today. You can use a basketball or you can use a playground ball. It doesn't matter. We're simply going to be warming up and learning some new ball skills. Today, I'm going to work with this playground ball. First thing I'm going to do is get my stance. That's how I stand when I dribble the, this ball. I'm going to keep my feet the same distance apart as my shoulders, and I'm simply going to do a two-handed push dribble, spreading out my fingers, working my elbows. Push, push. The harder I push, faster the ball comes up. Low! How low can you go? Bring it high. How high can you go keeping your hands on top of the ball? Great job. Now let's just use one hand. Spread the fingers, use the elbow, and push, 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 push. There you go. Remember, faster comes up Harder. There you go. Low. High. Switch hands. There you go. Get your dribble going. Spread out the fingers. Work the elbow. Push, push, push. Push. Nice. Low. Get it high. Great. You've got your right hand. you got your left hand. Let's combine the two with a crossover. Push, 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 push. You're creating the letter V in your crossover. Push. There you go. Now low. Get it low. Same concept. Get it higher. Learn to control the ball. Great job. Right hand, left hand, right and left hand. Now let's put some movement to this. Let's get the leg over the ball. Get your leg over the ball. A little warm up. Get that leg higher each time. Great job. That's leg over. Now, if you are more advanced in your dribbling skills, simply draw a line, find a line, put one foot on that line facing forward, put your back foot on that line, facing in another direction, but still on that line, and now simply dribble between your legs, hitting the line with the ball. I'm only looking at this line. I'm very soft on my hands. My fingers are spread out as I try to hit the line each time. Dribbling between the legs. It's a great skill and a fun skill. Now, let's do some ball skills without dribbling. First thing I'm going to do is drop, spin, catch. Drop the ball, spin my body, and catch it. The ball can only bounce once. Reach for the ball on your spin. Nice job, coach. A little lower, one-handed. All right, keep the glasses on. Yeah, nice job. Drop, spin, catch. Here's another one I'm going to drop back. Throw, clap, catch. Don't know if you can see me back there or hear me, but here we go. Throw, clap, catch. Throw, catch. Twelve. Count how many times you can clap and try to improve your number each time. Here we go. Fourteen. Nice job. Way to stay with it. Throw, clap, catch. Well, boys and girls, I've had a really good time with you today learning some dribbling skills. Go get a ball if you don't have one at home. 
Amazon, they'll get it to you the next day. Big Five, call them up, pick up service right outside. Get a ball, get it in your hands. You don't need anybody but yourself. Wait a minute, coach. I'm not really an athlete. <laughs> what? Yes, you are. You just don't know it yet. I'm a musician. Well, there's a lot of musicians that are also athletes as well. I'm an academic. Well, academics got to get outside and they got to get active. You can be an athlete as well. Be everything you can be. So I'll see you guys next time. But I think I'll send you out with a little piano dribbling this time. Thumb, pointer, middle, ring, pinky. Thumb, pointer, middle, ring, pinky. Thumb. Boys and girls, I'll see you next time. On the Carpenter campus. So long.